Stoss23 here. Today's knife therapy, I have a Volstead knife. Not this one. This is the Volstead Bellamy. This is the first uh, Volstead knife that I checked out. Beautiful cross-cut carbon fiber. Look at that stuff shimmer. I doubt it's coming through on the camera. This thing has broken. Look, just watch this. Whoop. This thing has broken in so nicely. Very, very fidgety. Uh, M390, nice and thinly ground, hollow grind on this one, comfortable in hand, several opening methods. You can open it here, you can open it with a top flipper, you can open it with the fuller, I mean, yeah, deep carry pocket clip, and I, I really like this one a lot. Um, I, I, I think I got this one, I don't know, a few months back, and uh, they reached out to me to check out a uh, new one that just came out, and I also now have a 10% off discount code. Um, it is Stasa23. I will leave it down in the description just in case you forget. But let's check it out. <laughs> First of all, the box. Okay, you get the sleeves. This is Volstead. It's got their logo right here. And then you get this. It's a uh, aluminum tin. Very, very nice right here. Like quality product. That's what it feels like. Let's see. So you open it up, besides the tin, you also get a zipper pouch, some swag. Oh wow, look at that. A nice little pat, pouch, I mean a patch, um, a sticker, sticker, and let's see. Very nice uh, card right here. So that's pretty cool, 120 day, full day, Full money back guarantee, return place ser service. Very cool. Damn, that's a really nice card. It's like almost like a plastic. And then the this is the nightshade, and there's uh, your pause and read right there. So I've I've been excited about this one because I I'm kind of late to the the Volstead ship. Um, I, I I don't usually like to I definitely don't like to get a knife from a company before I've experienced their knives first and uh, I, I, a lot of my friends have reviewed their knives and I kind of held off so I held off too long and I missed the first run of these uh, this is like I said the the nightshade and the first run I was kind of bummed because that one was, was aesthetically probably my favorite because it had one version that had uh, black micarta with like I think a copper bolster and they had one with a brass bolster and something else but that one was an M390 and I forgot that was over $100 and this one is going to be a little bit more budget friendly so this one you have uh, let's see contoured smooth G10 and this one is in gray G10 love it and look at that nice uh, pivot collar. It's a white G10 pivot collar right there. You got a lanyard hole, deep carry pocket clip that is recessed completely. Well done. Open back construction with two standoffs. And look at that. Love how they put that flipper tab back like that so you don't have anything pokey. And let's check out the first flip. <laughs> excellent excellent uh flipping action there and i'll tell you what i i've always loved this blade shape the first time i ever saw this type of blade shape on a folding knife was the lum tanta i mean the the bob lum bench made or is it no spider co i'm sorry the spider co lum that had this uh like downward sloping leaf shaped blade and i used to own one of them and I, for some stupid reason, I got rid of it. And uh, I don't know. When I saw this, it caught my eye. This particular one is in 154CM. The other one was in uh, M390. And I'm perfectly fine if, as long as, you know, for me, it was exciting with either the 154CM, knowing that the OEM on this is Kaiser. They do an excellent job with their 154CM. And, um, you know, the only other steel that I would have liked to see is 14C. But I I like 154 just a little bit more. Um, there's certain things about 14C that I love. But look at that lock access. Killing it. Oh, yeah. Oh, what? What? Crown spine as well? Yeah. 
I want to say, I think I looked on their site and I think these are 69 bucks. For 69 bucks, it, it's a no-brainer. Uh, you know, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the full testing and review this knife. But if you don't feel like waiting for that, I'm just gonna be honest. I, I can already tell there's a lot of things that could be great on this knife. You know, besides, it's a love or hate it design. I like the overall aesthetics. Action is already uh, nice and smooth, nice and snappy. Yeah. I already love the blade steel. It's ground nice and thin. I can feel it. It's not, you know, a super, super thin one, but it's 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 thinner than your average production knife. Uh, crown spine on here. Beautiful stone wash finish on there. Could have done without the Volstead Nightshade written on the blade right there, but at least it's done discreetly there. Good jimping. Um, I can already tell you, that this thing's going to perform great in pretty much every test that I do. Because when I'm doing cardboard, the way this tip is, is pointing down, especially it is when it's below this uh, pivot area, it's going to almost act as like, say, a recurve. Because whenever I catch the material, you go there, as your hand's doing that arcing down motion, you're going to start sliding into that belly all the way into it. So... You, you shouldn't have to worry about falling out of the cut at all. And then the er, the uh, ergo should be great because of the contoured scales. But, you know, we will let you know after the testing. And um, all the stuff that I'm cutting on the flat surface, this is going to be great. Because I, I can't really show you all like this, but I'm getting all the way to that belly with my knuckles on the table and I always do that kind of cutting with like a pinch cut like this pinch grip some which way and this thing should perform outstanding uh whew, you know 69 bucks if you if you have any Kaiser knives and you like them and this one appeals to you uh you, you're getting a few extra bells and whistles in my opinion like I said nice crown spine there you got a pivot collar you got a somewhat of a decorative pivot comfortable lock disengagement right there let's see yep you can slow roll it with the blade if you want to let's see can i mine has a little bit of oil on it right now but i'm sure i could probably spidey flick that if i wanted to uh that's the only thing that could have made this any better for me is a thumb stud right there would have been money or a blade hole let's see could you yeah I think you could put a blade hole right there i might have to do that later on so there you go that is the vosteed uh nightshade like i said i uh 10 discount code stasa 23 i'll leave that down in the description uh this is the bellamy i'm not sure if any of these are still available uh, if you like clip points this one is a super slicer very very lightweight because of the carbon fiber and uh, the action on this thing has gotten redonkulous look at that oh yeah so super super nice i'm excited i'm excited to test this one uh i just already know like i said i already know it's going to be a comfortable one let's check out the centering perfectly centered only thing this one doesn't have is uh, a, a tip up left handed carry. That's the only thing it's missing for my lefties out there. So, there you go. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please leave them down below. I hope everybody's having an absolute amazing day. I will see y'all on the next one. Peace, 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 peace.